to do I'm so real, I'm so real If you haven't heard about me, I'm a big fucking dick Yo, what's going on YouTube? Lee Haskins versus Ryan Barnett. Man, go ahead and check out the fight, man. Go ahead and check out the fight. If I, I see a link to the fight, man, I'll leave a link in the description uh, below. But yeah, man, um, I I don't know how much they pay Lee Haskins to fight this guy, man. I don't know, man, because um, uh, this dude is a Adam Booth you know, protege, you know what I'm saying, he's in Adam Booth's camp, looks like Adam Booth been trading him ever since he was like 14 years old or whatever like that, but, um, yeah, that's, yo, if, if Adam Booth is in somebody's corner, just, just, and you're a betting man, bet on that dude for the knockout, man, you know what I'm saying, I know it went like 12 rounds, whatever like that, but this, this, this kid, um, Ryan Barnett, man, he was shooting for a KO, man. He knocked Lee Haskins down a few times. And uh, big ups to Lee Haskins, man. He looked good, too, man. But he's kind of, like, long on the tooth at that at that weight class. He's kind of, like, long on the tooth. He was, like, what, what uh, 33 years old. It's not old, but I guess in, like, boxing years, it's kind of it's up there, you know what I'm saying? It's mature, you know. It's mature age, you know, for, uh, in boxing years, you know. But, um... Yeah, man, I, I, I enjoyed the fight, man. I like what I saw. I like what I saw. I like what I saw. Um, Ryan Barnett, he's twenty five. Uh, he's got a belt now. Um, hopefully, he shoots for you know unifying uh, belts at uh, you know at bantamweight. You know, uh, and I wish him the best, man. But yeah, he's got to get it done now, man, because this style is definitely a young man's style. You know. I mean, we just saw what uh, Gene Pascal he got got undressed. You know, those ambush fighters and stuff like that. They like to keep their hands down, um, like the lunge in with the uh, you know loopy hooks and stuff like that. And, and they rarely use the jab. I'm like, yo, when is this kid gonna use this jab? This Ryan Barnett kid, you know, and um, he just used the jab at like. The tail end of the uh the fight, whatever. I'm like, man, he he'll be okay if he used the jab, you know. But I don't think that's the the method to the madness of the 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 style, especially like the ambush style and stuff like that, an orthodox style, you know. But um, it seems like they rely a lot on you know foot movement, you know counter punches to get their offense off, and you know lunging in with um. You know, being very explosive, lunging in with shots and letting their hands go um, when an uh, opponent attempts to clinch and whatnot. So that's basically what I saw, man. But, um, yeah, man, I, I'm not a 118 guy, man. If you're a 118 guy, um, let me know which uh, fights you want to see. It looks like he, he's ranked in the WBO. So maybe grabbing the IBF belt will push him up in the WBO uh, rankings and stuff like that. Let's see if he was ranked any other weight class. Um, uh, in the WBA, no. In the WBC, I don't see anything. So maybe you be shooting for that WBO belt, man. All right, man. Let me know what y'all think, okay? All right, bye.